security guru here. In this particular video, I'm going to show you guys how to replace a bad hard drive and or install a new hard drive into your DVR. First, locate the screws that hold the top cover of your DVR. Then, unscrew them so that we can slide the cover off. There's a few different ways to remove the top cover in different DVRs. This one in particular, you slide back and then raise. Once inside the DVR, we will locate the SATA port for the data and the power port on the main board. As you can see, in this particular DVR, it has two SATA ports for two hard drive bays and a power port. You can match it into the hard drive slots this area here is for the second hard drive where we can slip another hard drive into. Look underneath the DVR to gain access to the screws that hold on to the hard drive. Lay the DVR on a flat surface for easy screw removal. First, remove only two screws so that the hard drive does not fall out. Assist the hard drive by placing your hand on the bottom of the drive as you remove the other two screws. Then carefully place the DVR back onto your workbench and slowly remove the cables plugged into the hard drive. This now completes the removal of the hard drive from your DVR. Take the new replacement drive and place it into the DVR. Plug the corresponding cables. First, you can plug in the power. Then plug in the SATA port. Carefully flip the DVR with your other hand holding the hard drive in place. Take the screws and screw it into the hard drive. You can do two screws first before you let go of the hard drive. You can then put the DVR back down into your workbench so that you can screw the rest of the screws. You have now completed the hardware portion of installing the hard drive. Now take the case back, slowly slide it back into position, and go ahead and re-screw the screws that you removed. Next, I will show you guys how to initialize the hard drive within the DVR menu. Some DVRs do ask you in the beginning, but we will skip this step and show you the manual. First, log into your DVR. Enter your password. Go to HDD. Check the hard drive and click Initialize. Every DVR will have its own different type of menu for the hard drive portion, but they'll all look similar. It will always say Format or Initialize. Once the status says Normal, you have completed initializing the hard drive. Double check the property, make sure that it's read-write. Double check your recording settings, make sure that your schedule is still ongoing. And double check again one more time that your hard drive status is normal and properly reading and writing. Thank you for watching. Hopefully we were able to help you install a new hard drive or replace a bad hard drive into your DVR. If you have any further problems, comment below. Uh, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe so we can make more videos for you guys.